This is your 3-minute radiation fallout forecast for the weekend of March 23, 2012. In Canada, radar imagery from Environment Canada shows moderately heavy precipitation between Calgary and Regina moving towards Winnipeg. There are also strong storms in the area of Sudbury through Ottawa and moving into the Detroit-Windsor area. Because of the jet stream position, I would be more concerned with the rainfall in Saskatchewan than the rainfall in Ontario at this time. In the U.S., CRWS jet stream analysis places Northern California, Washington, and Oregon at risk. However, rain forecasts for this region appear to be mild through the weekend. The heaviest rain will be through the Midwest and East Coast over the next 72 hours, but the moisture from this system is coming from the Gulf of Mexico. There is potential for strong storms, and I would monitor and telecast for severe weather alerts in these areas. In Europe, European jet stream from Meteo France shows it will be pushing through Europe over the weekend. There will be potential for strong storms there as well. The following cities have rain forecasted from Weather Online. Lisbon, Helsinki, Riga, Minsk, Munich, and Roma. Nuke Report There was notice of an unusual event at Cooper Nuclear in Nebraska due to a Freon leak from a glycol compressor. This created a potentially unsafe localized atmosphere in the area. I encourage anyone living near this plant to contact their local news affiliate to cover the story. At the McGuire Power Plant in North Carolina, a condition was found that could induce a fire in the steam generator block. This potential condition could adversely affect the ability of the plant to achieve and maintain cold shutdown of Unit 2 in an emergency. You may have noticed the recent seismic activity in Wisconsin, Arkansas, and South Carolina, as well as Alaska, California, Wyoming, and Mexico over the past few days. Please visit FukushimaFacts.com for links to earthquake monitors in the U.S. and globally. Canadians have their own system, which can be found at Natural Resources Canada's website. If you live in a seismically active area, have a plan and be prepared. Please join us at Nuked Radio Monday through Friday from 12 to 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for a one-month public service broadcast to bring people up to speed on Fukushima, radiation levels, and how to learn to live with radiation in your daily lives. This is the reality of humans trying to coexist with nuclear power. This message has been brought to you by Radchik and the Orion Talk Radio Network. We care about you because your government doesn't. Stay safe.